Whenever you read a good book, somewhere in the world a door opens to let in more light. My um, favorite book is um, Green Lantern, and this is what he looks like. And I like his ship, and he's, I like to be smart. Don't give this book a cat a bowl of milk. Can you show me the cover? I like the sleepover girls because me and my friends like to um, play with dolls and we like um, to do these at sleepovers. Hello, my name is Ava. I'm in the fourth grade. And whenever I go to school, when we go to the library, the, all the the first book I pick is usually Farmer Cat. Like, he's really weird and funny like I am. So this isn't one of my favorite books out of all Joe Cole's books. Once you learn to read, you'll be forever free. Capstone Press was an existing publisher in 1990 when Bob and Jim Coughlin acquired it. Successful in several family businesses, the Coughlins decided to go into publishing and took ownership of Capstone Press, which had a handful of employees and a few unfinished titles. Capstone's audience was young readers. The Coughlins committed themselves to creating a successful publishing company that would make a difference in the lives of those who read its books. When we first started, it was mostly a matter of passion. We'd go to the conferences, meet with our customers, and they, they told us they needed materials that were really easy, that, that they, had, they had a picture in their mind of a, a boy who could read, but just didn't like it. As the business has developed, it's become much more than just a, a company owned by an individual family. We're now 400 or so families. I'm fond of saying that this company is my fourth child and that I consider my colleagues in the company my co-parents. It's our shared responsibility for this, this company. There are perhaps no days of our childhood we lived so fully as those we spent with a favorite book. A look at the timeline of the last 25 years of Capstone is impressive. In the first years, they expanded their line of titles. And through the years, Capstone kept growing, entering new forms of publishing in print, digital, and online formats. Year after year, Capstone focused on publishing what young readers find to be an attractive, captivating, and fun reading experience. I like that Capstone really stayed on their mission and their focus. We always stayed we, elementary into middle school. How do we make it educational? How do we make it so the librarian can say, I've got material like that, why don't you come into my library? And so it was passion for addressing what educators want and what the kids want. So we want to make sure kids know how to read because that's the best thing we can do for our customers. And that really drives why people work at Capstone. Throughout its history, Capstone has always attracted highly creative people. They are encouraged to think of new ways to serve their readers, to stay ahead of the curve with innovations and do it with passion. Helping children develop a love of reading and learning, no matter their ability level, is at the heart of Capstone. This passion for creating inspired learning has made Capstone the most trusted publisher of children's books and digital solutions for libraries, classrooms, and consumers for more than 25 years. Capstone content comes in print and digital formats, Capstone Interactive, eBooks, personalized reading platform Myon, databases PebbleGo. Whether print, digital, or yet-to-be-discovered formats, Capstone provides kids with the content they love. A book is a dream, 
that you hold in your hand. Librarians, teachers, and parents all have good things to say about Capstone. As far as the future of, of education and, and publishing, we spend a lot of money developing beautiful books. So I don't think that's going to go away. I, I think there's a, a concept of blended learning, that you're accessing information and media through both physical books and technology. Fun learning. I'd like to say that Capstone was all about fun learning. When I think of my legacy, I'd like to, you know, on my gravestone, woo-hoo! <laughs> our most precious resource is our children. We owe them the gift of reading. Reading introduces them to the world so they can face the challenges of the future and live meaningful, purposeful lives. The more that you read, the more things you will know. The more that you learn, the more places you'll go. Capstone, 25 years of awesome, and more to come. <laughs>